Welcome to the afternoon voice. Here are top 10 headlines. 21000 tons of fertilizers were handed over to Sri Lanka by Indian High Commission in Colombo. Aam Aadmi Party MLA Saurabh Bhardwaj slammed the BJP on ongoing liquor scam case against Delhi Deputy CM Manish Sisodia. He said that the BJP is misusing the power against the opposition to suppress its voice. Senior scientist Devashish Mohanty appointed as director of the National Institute of Immunology. Kerala governor Arif Mohammad Khan said PM Modi has declared the next 25 years as India's Amrit Kal to create new consciousness among youth so that they realize dreams of freedom fighters. BJP leader Sushil Kumar Modi said Bihar Chief Minister Nitish Kumar squarely responsible for woes of teaching job aspirants as education ministry has been with JDU for over 15 years. Delhi Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal said in Gujarat poll bound we will make healthcare cheap and accessible. The 150 year old British era Karnak bridge can be demolished will be rebuilt by 2024. After Shiv Sena leader Aditya Thakre's Shiv Samvad Yatra, Uddhav Thakre will launch Mahaprabodhan Yatra in Thane. NCP MLA Jitendra Award urges Central Railway to review the decision of replacing non-AC locals with AC trains. Maharashtra Minister Chandrakant Patil said the state government will bear the education expenses of college students who have lost their parents in the covid-19 pandemic these were the top 10 headlines stay tuned for more updates